Now another piece of content you'll be getting every day is a little bit of philosophy. This is just context, it's more theories on why these things work, and we'll go into a little bit of anatomy, we'll go into a little physiology, we'll do some myth busting, um, but each day there'll be kind of a new topic that we'll talk about. And this is just to expand your mind and to allow you to apply these different principles, these workouts, these trainings, all in a new light and stronger way. So the first piece of philosophy that I would like to add is um, this concept of health versus fitness. Now, most people, when they think of workouts and they think of getting in shape, all they think about is fitness. They got to go hard and, and sweat in the gym and tear their muscles down so they can rebuild. And all these concepts, to me, are false. They're improper ways to train. So... What I like to focus on more is health, because if you generate a high level of health through your fitness training, through your exercise training, right? It's not fitness. We want to do health. And so the more you focus on health, the higher quality of life you will live. And if your health is at a high level, your fitness will automatically be this high level baseline. And so that's kind of the concept that I want you to think about. We're training for health. We're training for longevity of life. We're training to heal the body, to strengthen the body, to stabilize the body. Those are the, those are the ways we're training. We're not trying to break PRs and, and set world records and destroy our body so we can feel that growth. All we want is the slow, subtle changes. And we'll explain as these principles and philosophy comes out of why this is so important and why it's so powerful. But truly, we're looking for some exponential growth. So we're going to build the fundamentals in the background. And if you've seen the workout for this week, it's very, very simple. But it's super, super powerful. See, most people can't work out for very long because their joints get destroyed. But it's because they focus on fitness. And fitness is a very intense style of training. We want to work on health, which is a much more directed and focused and intentional style of training that will train your nervous system opposed to your muscles, which we'll get into later. But right now, I want you to focus on thinking about health. We're not trying to destroy the body. We're trying to rebuild the body. And so that's one of the key principles key philosophies behind why we're doing what we're doing. 